Let's say we've been given some kind of process G, which has the form 8 times quantity minus 3s plus 1 over s, and we are told to design a feedback controller using internal model control. And in this example or video, I will go over how we can go about doing that. And so the first thing we're going to do is first analyze the control block diagrams that we've become familiar with and recognize that this component here is equal to our controller GC that we will ultimately derive. And if you perform the control block diagram algebra, uh, we will realize that GC is equal to Q, our internal model controller, divided by 1 minus G tilde, which is our uh, essentially our process, transfer function times Q, where Q is equal to uh, some kind of filter F times G tilde minus inverse. And so uh, G tilde is composed of a stable part, which is G tilde minus, as well as an unstable part, G tilde plus. And if we um, begin to uh, analyze this uh, GP function here, we'll recognize in this situation that G tilde minus is equal to the stable part of our transfer function, which is 8 over S, and G tilde plus is equal to this unstable part or the numerator dynamics, which is equal to minus 3S plus 1. And so if we now uh, look at the denominator of our um, controller transfer function that we're trying to design, 1 minus g tilde uh, times q is equal to 1 minus g tilde plus times g tilde minus times g tilde minus inverse times our filter f. And the nice thing here is that this cancels out, so our denominator becomes 1 minus g tilde plus times f. And if we uh, rigorously determine what our numerator is of this uh, function, hang on one sec, uh, we will find uh, q is equal to f times g tilde minus inverse which is equal to uh, the inverse of this, which is s over 8 times our filter f, which will let be equal to 1 over lambda s plus 1. Now, if we turn back to our uh, denominator here and look at this term, uh, 1 minus, and then we plug in what g tilde plus is, we'll have minus 3s plus 1, and we're going to divide it by lambda s plus 1 because our filter was 1 over lambda s plus 1. Uh, and this is equal to lambda s plus 1 minus minus 3s, sorry, minus 3s, and then minus 1, divided by uh, lambda s plus 1, because so we can add this and cancel these ones. And what we will find is that we will have uh, lambda plus 3 uh, times s divided by lambda s, sorry, plus 1. And so if we now uh, turn back to what uh, our uh, controller transfer function was, uh, gc, we plug in what we found for q, which was s over 8 times the quantity 1 over lambda s plus 1. And we're going to now multiply it by the inverse of this because 1 minus g tilde times q was in the denominator of gc. So we'll have lambda s plus 1 over s times lambda plus 3. And what you'll notice, something very cool here, is these terms cancel and this s also cancels. And what we're left with is 1 over 8 times the quantity lambda plus 3. And what you'll note about this is every term in this equation is a constant value. 
Uh, so this is equal to your controller gain KC, uh, which is for a P only controller. And so what is the takeaway here? Well, if we take a look at our process transfer function G, we'll recognize that G has the form one over S in it. And because it has this one over S in it, it has what I call natural integrating behavior. And uh, what's cool about this is uh, we can get away with just using a P only controller and these kinds of sy systems in which <clears throat> we only have to deal with uh, this kind of stuff. And so uh, just to, to kind of hit on the point, if we have a uh, process transfer function that has one over S in it, um, it's really nice for us. And a lot of processes do have this um, internal or intrinsic property. Uh, so we can get away with just P only controllers and they'll naturally regulate themselves. We don't have to worry about unbounded behavior, which can lead to explosions and other bad things in, in the real world. And so um, this wraps up an example problem of the internal model control. Um, I hope you guys find it useful. Let me know if you have any questions and thanks for watching.